for all of the community settings, nine times out of 10, it is going to be private pay. You can refer back to if you have a long-term care policy, your long-term care policy may be able to supplement an assisted living or a memory care community. They are not going to offset the cost of your rent in a senior housing complex or an independent living community. There are a handful of communities throughout the state of Connecticut listed under those four categories that when they were built, their model had to include housing that allowed a Medicare or a Medicaid payment. Often though, those apartments are, you know, snatched up really quickly and the availability is very slim on those. So when somebody has those limited resources, there are a handful of communities out there, but then people may have to explore a long-term care facility or what some people commonly think of as a skilled nursing or a convalescent home.